what's going on guys it's your boy again uh back with another video and i wanted to uh, have a discussion i was going to record this yesterday but i got busy uh, i wanted to have a discussion with regards to the new uh silhouette that was uh reviewed on twitter or uh, i just extracted a picture since i'm recording this on my phone and um it's, it's kind of like a silhouette uh that resembles that of chun li uh right but um there is a bit of um, an extra kick or something special with regards to this new reveal okay so what is actually happening happening here is that uh, this Chun-Li silhouette in particular matches two particular Chun-Li styles okay and um, um, one of them is considered the fire Chun-Li and then the other one is considered the seaward Chun-Li okay so um, they both appear to not be any of it they're not legendary characters they're not like special characters and according to the reveal I saw in the past okay uh, they're actually supposed to be this obviously being fire and as you know we don't have water in the faction so this is actually like a wind character okay um i actually um was able to um have a view of how the characters actually play out to see if i'm gonna be a bit hyped up for it okay you can actually see a video of that on shiny s's video uh because it does show a bit more details i believe I, I think it's from the CN version. I'm not really sure per se, but yeah, he does have uh, more details and uh, you know our uh, reviews on the character as well. And you can see all the kits and how they actually uh, transform or transfer in the actual gameplay you know, scenario. And uh, based on what I've seen from the two of them, uh, I'm kind of like leaning towards the wind one right now based on the gameplay but then again as you know the fire faction um do uh or does need more you know our characters to actually make it stronger so i would actually wouldn't mind if it's also if i get a fire version as well so now uh, we actually don't know how it's going to be obtained okay as you know there is typically about three styles so you can actually obtain a character uh i'm just hoping uh first of all i uh if you look at the uh, twitter account uh it does say a new legendary fighter is making their way into the mall world warriors okay so it's making its way to the mall okay so now that gives me a slightly bit of a concern but i'm going to get to what i'm talking about here okay um when it's a legendary fighter um i'm trying to let me have a look here on the side here and see when uh camera was coming around uh the day or when they showed you know the silhouette for street poison uh did they actually mention a new legendary character or they just say something else okay because this could make it different so uh in the um in the poison you know our version the date mention uh the newest fighter is here on the side of justice who do you think is making their way to the streets world warriors right so uh i was gonna be a bit concerned about the fire emoji before with the fist but it's something that uh, uh crunchy rose side of you know the street tool typically shows more often so i'm gonna just say that i guess it has nothing to do with whatever faction we expect to come out however with the fact that there's still a new legendary fighter could she be a legendary and if that's the case then there is um, actually a crazy, uh, you know, um, case where, you know, um, they're actually, you know, going to expect, you know, to only have one of the two characters, or maybe both of them. I can't really say for sure. But my concern now, because you can only acquire them at the mall, okay, um, is that you would probably you know let's let's go to the mall like i was trying to say before uh the mall i can't remember if this is also where you get fashion blanca because that is one method you know you have to go through a series of you know getting several points and eventually get the character but i doubt that's going to be the case uh it might be more in the mode of you know fashion sakura where you may have to pay for the character and we have to pay for the character you know being free to play uh it looks like we're going to well, I'm going to have to miss out on that. There is only one character if he gets... Well, I don't even want to, like, encourage any sort of, like, payment, 
whatever. So I'm not even going to say nothing about that. So, um, overall, um, I think she's a great character. Or they're great characters because it's two of them. Uh, if they're going to give us one of them, um, honestly, I'm leaning towards the win version because she's much better right i see her being able to replace the current existing channel lead that we have uh but with the fire version then i guess the fire you know um uh, faction has an additional character you can actually add to build up your team and of course i don't know what the snitch is like if you play them side by side if you do get put of them in the event but that's just pretty much what i wanted to say about that uh, i hope she's not paid to 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 acquire uh, otherwise you know i'm probably gonna have to miss out on that um i do see another silhouette that's coming out soon okay uh probably out uh, a few hours ago uh, i'm already late on that i'll probably have a discussion on that as well and that's uh gonna be on my boy vega all right uh thanks for watching and tuning into this video today i'll be releasing the other one shortly uh, have yourself a great day cheers